when Muzi and his grandmother asked him to sell chickens to pay for his school fees, she never imagined she was raising a boy who would become a celebrated sports star. Muzi is the first black African to get his national colors for jockeying. These are awarded only to the country's best sportsmen and women. From a rural township, Muzieni is reaching greatness in what is considered to be a sport for the elite. A lot of the jockeys, the, the hard workers and that, Muzi takes that extra step, he, he rides a lot of work, he tries to study as much form as he can. The first black South African jockey to get Springbok colours, Muzi has undoubtedly represented his country with excellence. He's ridden a lot of winners, eh? I mean, already he's over 100 winners for the season, which is great, he's third on the log. But Muzi did not get things on a silver platter. He's a product of tenacity. This is where he comes from, Clement Wazulu Natal. Raised up by most, mostly my grandma, my grandmother, and my grandfather. My dad was working up in Joburg, and uh, later on. He came down when I was turning 15, 16. So I wasn't like a normal kid where every day I could go out and play. I was quite tied down to helping the home chores. The chores were to, we were selling chickens, and able to pay for all the head pocket money, able to pay for school fees. When Muzi turned 14, his father suggested that he visit a jockey academy in Durban. He'd been captivated by horse riders he saw in a newspaper and thought it would be a good hobby for his son. I was very reluctant at first because, I knew, like I said to you, I knew very little about the sport. I'd, not, I'd never seen even like people of color, there wasn't much, it was still a very quite uh, white dominated sport. My grandparents motivated me to give it a, sh uh, a, sh give it a chance. Uh, I went up to the academy, they said I must, at 14 years old, they said I must come back a year later. He warmed up to the idea and joined the academy as advised making new friends in the process. He used to come to me in the morning and work for me and weekends come stay at my place and um, I took him as my apprentice. And um, yeah, we, the academy obviously teaches him how to ride and that and then uh, when he gets here, I just show him a few finer things of which way I like him to ride. And yeah, he adapted well. Still selling chickens to help his family while at the same time working on improving his game. In no time, Muzi had become a promising jockey, winning races. Being small statured and everything uh, made me easy to get used to, to, to be able to ride, be behind the horse and to learn the skills. But also you've got to have a bit of natural, natural, like physical attributes. I'm small, I think I'm well built for the sport. But something had to give. I did start to manage to battle to balance that out at school because I was starting to be competitive. I was riding for one of the biggest stables in the country. I was racing, I was racing in Durban and quite busy. And uh, I had a successful apprenticeship. I finished my claiming in my fourth year, meaning riding more than 50 winners as an, as an apprentice. I finished claiming in my end of my third year. He never gave up school and still matriculated in 2005. At this stage, he had already been making a name for himself, later riding in countries like Brazil, Zimbabwe and South Korea. He made history in 2010 when he was awarded Springbok Colors, the first black South African jockey to achieve this. 
To date, this 27-year-old has more than 700 wins as a professional jockey, taking the prestigious President's Champions Challenge and the Betting World Derby in the process. An astonishing jockey whose success shows that in life, it doesn't matter how you start, you will be remembered for how you finish. Absolutely fantastic. Well done, Muzie Ni. Well, that's it for now. Join us again next time as we explore the lives of those who dare to dream. The people who are committed to making South Africa a country of possibilities. My name is Mpola Gaje. Cheers.